Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And on the menu, action from Europe's Premier Club competition, the Champions League. This the first leg of the semi-final. It's Benfica up against Ajax. Well, Derek, it could be cagey and it could be tight, but we've got some of the best players on view here, and they'll want to show just how good they really are. I can't wait for this tie to start. Jan Vertonghen starts alongside Nicolas Sotamendi in central defence. Julian Weigel plays alongside Joao Mario in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. the starting 11 for Ajax well the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good but it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game Underway now in this Champions League semi-final first leg. And they need to get tight. Opportunity it is. And the keeper did more than enough. Julian Weigel. Rafa, offside, a tight one. Edson Alvarez. Tadic has it. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And crossing towards the far post. Well, it looked promising, but his timing was off. Well, great work out wide, but he just gets himself into an offside position there. how to rob them of possession will he play it in and pressing really high good work to win it back high up the pitch and a useful cross no nonsense clearance to jump in front and a goal the opening statement in this semi-final how important can that prove to be Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Ooh, One nil then. 
número 17, Molly Wind. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw in. Moving forward effectively. Grafenberg, determined block. Grimaldo. Grimaldo with it. Here's Berghaus. Into the advanced position. Must score! Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. And there's the delivery. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Allaire. And he might be through here. Well, I think fair to say, Stuart, not one for his personal scrapbook. Well, that's really wayward. His technique completely let him down there. Joao Mario and a fine tackle couldn't find a teammate throw in here Grimaldo Seferovic Oh, couldn't quite find his teammate. It's opening up for them. Will it be? And how about that for a save? Delivering it, and dealt with that ball comfortably. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Oh, great play. And still an opportunity. A wonderful intervention. Well, the goalkeeper got there in the end. Well, his recovery is brilliant here, so athletic. looking pass now the task is to remain focused and a goal to level this contest all even well let's have another look it's a wonderful bit of interplay to start the move off but I think the keeper has made a mistake here while it's a decent finish it should go in at that near post So underway again, following the goal that made things level. He's going forward well here. Oh, and couldn't convert. Allaire. 
Well, putting it wide from there, disappointing. Yaremchuk. Getting forward, but quick thinking defensively. The referee has decided that two additional minutes are in order. And plenty of room in the wide area. And teammates to play it to. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Clearance wasn't decisive. Good physical play. Can he convert? Making sure it didn't get past him. The first half here comes to an end. Well, Rafa certainly was influential in the first half, it's fair to say. Interested to get your assessment. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. Second half of this Champions League semi-final first leg underway. Very difficult challenge to perform, but he succeeded. Ajax in a position of menace, but really sticking to the task defensively. Aller. Could play it in, but nothing doing in an attacking sense. He takes aim. Well, for power, 10 out of 10. For placement, maybe 8. Attacking possibilities for Ajax. Well read to ease the pressure. Roman Yaremchuk. And you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Good looking sequence. An incisive pass, and he could cash in. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2 1. Roman Yaremchuk. That piece of play very easy on the eye. This looks promising. Terrific block. One goal down, but now a corner kick. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? Who can he pick out? Still could be dangerous. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. Joao Mario. And the keeper more than equal to the task.
Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. And over comes the corner. Well, as a defender, that will suit you down to the ground. And this is Weigel. Committed challenge. Well, racing past his man. An alert piece of defending. Well, it did look dangerous for a moment, but the keeper has it now. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Sebastian Allaire. Klassen has it. Well, possibilities in the centre. Allaire. It's still alive. Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Allaire. And a tidy challenge. Well, the fans believe there's hope here. Can the players respond now? Can they hit on the break? Well, I'm still amazed that stayed out. He looks to have done everything right, didn't he? Lost possession. A real opening now. Still alive. Well, they can keep possession of it now. They're trying to get right into his face. And time for the change now. Rafa. Well, just listen to this crowd. They want a bit more. They know there's still plenty of time to find an equaliser. Surely they get another chance. Maybe two. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. This could be the equaliser. But no, when your goalkeeper comes up with a save like that late in the game, you have cause to be thankful. Well, that could be a key moment. They have to take those sort of chances. They won't get too many more, but let's credit the goalkeeper. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Trying to deliver it accurately. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Joao Mario. Well, very effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Well, this might be the final opportunity to draw level. Substitution time it is here. Over it comes. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. And no luck keeping possession. On the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Dusan Tadic. Tadic. Can he finish them off? Well, body in the way. A oh, splendid save. And it gives them some hope here. Not long left, though. If they can score again from this corner, it probably would be the end of the story. Short. 
the cross not quite imaginative enough and they're going for the short one that's excellent defending following the cross delivered into the area here and still dangerous shot attempted and the ball is loose well threat about it and there goes the final whistle it's a victory for the visitors in the first leg of this tie yeah that was a tight game and I think they just about deserve their lead but it's a slender one and they'll certainly need to defend well in the second leg if they're to reach the final Well, one player who certainly will have pleased his manager, Dusan Tadic. What did you make of his performance? Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.